Oh, so I learned something today. That there's this flowering plant that's uh, that's native to southeastern Africa called the cat, Q-A-T. Uh, and, you know, it's not found in the U.S. So, Fievel was right. There's no cats in America. <clears throat> We're checking out First Dwarf today. This is by Star Drifters. It is in playtest mode at the moment, coming out sometime. We're a dwarf. We have ourselves a mech, and we're going to run around and build a base. Now that you have a song stuck in your head, streets are paved with cheese. Let's try this thing out. And I've always, I've searched for a long time for a good old-fashioned Fible joke. Finally found one. We get a good, like, intro cartoon thing here if it wants to play. There it goes. Oh, that intro. <laughs> this is a playtest, by the way. What an intro. <clears throat> All right. So, yeah, yeah. The first thing that came to mind also for me was um, Light Year Frontier or something like that's the name of it, where you're like a guy with a mech. It's like a farming one. This is a little more fighty. It wasn't natural for sure. But next time, maybe work on your landing technique. Remember, this is a playtest. I assume the voice acting is, is temporary. I don't know. Uh, I'm a dwarf. This is me, right here. I'm this fella right here. I'm in this freaky land. There it is. Um, we're going to follow the tutorial and see what it does. See what it does here. Um, I'll, I can, in a moment, I'll be able to switch between the dwarf and the mech. And I guess maybe the flying machine. But anyway, we're going to come over here. We're going to go build or fix, fix my mech. Holy Mount F. There we go. Uh, get to work. Just look at this mech. That's what I call good dwarf workmanship. A few dents, that's all. I'll fix them right away. <laughs> I am a dwarf and I'm piloting a mech. The mech is ready. Time to get in. All right. Let's let's get in. How do we do it? Control. Now let's see what's left of the airship. All right. So my my uh, my airship is a little broken. Let's go pick some things up. Uh, what do we hit? F. Pick up the chimney, the broken engine, the roof. Um, oh, there's my hammer. We can go switch. We can hold tab and we can switch over. So now this is where I can do this. I can I can be the dwarf. There I am. Grab my hammer. Oh Weak. my hammer. Good thing it didn't fall far. Mm hmm Oh my hammer. Um, I can also pick stuff up this way. And run around here if I don't want mech. My mech. We can use you can use this to hit things. I guess that tree is not mineable. There's a chimney. Grab this thing, and I'll show you how we mine things. We use that. It's a multi-purpose hammer. It hits rocks. It hits trees. Um, I don't know what else it does. It builds things. Builds things. We will be building like, like a bit of a, a bit of a base here. I go grab all those things. But anyways, we can do things faster with our mech. So we're gonna go do that. Uh, I guess I haven't gotten all my parts yet. So let's go. Oh, there it is. Yeah, let me get my mech and then we'll do it. Hop back in here. Uh, control. There we go. Yep, get myself a lamp. Is that it? What I could. We can look around. 
Some pieces might have landed elsewhere, but I think it's a good spot. Just smell the forest. Time to build a base. How's the audio sound? My my um, thing is acting up. Sound everything sound okay? Here we go. Um, anyway, I'm clearing stuff out. Let's go and build a base. We'll put it over here. This is a nice flat spot. This works. So we're gonna hit control and put down my main base. There we go. We are ready to start a new colony. Wood and stone. Or how they say it. I got a bird on me. Go gather some wood. Okay. We have some wood, now it's time for stone. Finally, wood dries or rots. And stone lasts for ages. Yeah. You can build a shelter out of wood, but you cannot build a house without stone. Well, I mean... Pretty sure my house right here doesn't have any stone. <laughs> so... But I'm no dwarf. Anyway. Well, let's go find a quarry. It's over here. We do have a map. It tells us where to go. There's a mana thing here. What mana is a, a, a deal we have to deal with? Uh, and here it is right here. And we will we will deal with that in a minute. Extract mana. Oh, I just plug in. Okay. All right, juiced up. Let's go over here. We can hold shift. We can run. We go found ourselves a quarry. This looks like a good place to dig. Wait a moment. Look at these scratches. Somebody has been here before us. A rock must have broken off. That's it. These are wild lands. We are the first to explore here. What's that sound? We're not what the first. I think something that doesn't want to be our friend. Must be <laughs> must be a Tesla. Okay, so when we swing, we can like we hit. It took me a minute to figure this out, so we can we can block. We can also hit, and if we time it right, we get like a, an additional attack. That didn't, actually didn't work. There we go. We can like combo up some swings if we if we hit. I'm not sure if it matters like. What was this? I think as long as we don't hit when it gets to the middle. I, I'm still working on it. I haven't quite figured that out yet. I think it used to be a wild animal. What on earth happened to it? I'm not sure, but I think it was something even the songs are afraid to mention. Oh, so I'm bad. I'm bad at this. So I guess we gotta hit it before it gets to the middle. Yeah. And then we get like a we get a freebie combo attack thing. Maybe we'll get a tutorial here in a minute. Done. No, such things never appear one at a time. It's like an illness spreading through the body. It's only the beginning. Well, here we have a stone to smash. Cool. Find quarry. Found it. Get some stone. Have you done enough digging? Nope. Yes, that's it. Now we can build a well on the mana spring. The colony buildings need mana just like my armor. Okay, uh, it's building time. Before we do building time, I want to show you that we can be the dragon. And we can fly around. Let's just head up here and see what we can what we can look at. We can go look around. Look at this place. Ooh, look, there's a question mark over there. Is there someone there? There's something walking around next to my base. Anyway, we can go around and look around. We can fly with Miss Dragon. Pretty neat. Anyway, uh, I want to go back to being mech. Here we go. Oh, she just teleports back. Uh, so let's go build a... What's, oh, mana well first. Okay, so let's go over here. And um, let's go get... A mana well. On the mana spring. Is it emote only? <laughs> okay. I could dig stone all day, but I've sure had enough of cutting wood. Yeah. It's high time to build a sawmill and power it up with a mana pipeline. High time. So over here is a forest that we can put sawmills next to, so we will do that. 
not that one. I want build mode, and we want to in the resources tab and a sawmill. Like that. And it just sort of builds. I'm gonna need some more wood here in a minute, so I'm gonna go ahead and get get some wood. I wonder if I can just walk up to here and just sort of help it out. Oh, you know what? It's not gonna work because it needs mana. Connected to a mana pipeline. So mana is the power source here. So we're gonna come in here. We're gonna build and grab the mana pipeline, which is gonna work just like a um, power line, basically. It can't go too far out, but we can like connect this thing so we can go like just a couple of squares out and just sort of connect it up here. Like that. Now we have to build a stone mine and a quarry and connect it to the pipeline. You said you could dig stone all day. Work first, play later. Okay. Let's build a stone mine. Right there. And we want to build one of those. Connect from there. And then into that, but I think I have to go. I'll go there first. Done. Okay. The sun is setting. Not good. We still haven't prepared for unwanted guests. Expecting someone? All the filthiest things in this world like to come out at night. I can breathe fire, but I'm afraid you won't make it. We could use some defense. Oh, yeah, she can breathe fire. That's her attack. Let's hurry up, my poor defenseless true. Okay, we need defensive turrets. Let's build them. In defensive mode, we've got a uh, defensive turret, we've got a raven watchtower, balloon tower, mortar tower, defensive wall, and gate. Yeah, the the these make it feel like like a tower defense kind of thing. I don't know if how tower defense it is. We'll make we need two of these, so I'll put one there. And I'll put one over here if I have the wood for it. I need, I'm short one wood and nine nine stone, so Ooh, choppy choppy. It's just my recording software. I was playing this earlier and it was running just fine, so I think it just doesn't seem to like my recording software running at the same time. I was I was surprised at how well optimized it was for being a playtest. I was playing it earlier. Yeah, the voice acting, I'm not sure like if this is the plan or if it's just um it might it might just be like placeholder voice acting or whatever because it's just a play test so i don't know um also i don't know if i need to defend that place over there so we'll just put my turret like mm, um there is fine we want some, want some walls as well we need to connect them to the pipeline I keep the wrong button tabs always build button but not not this time so we want to connect up like from there to that and we need one over here. To that. Oops. There we go. Okay, and now we need some walls. Where was the walls? Over here? Defensive wall. Um. There we go. I need a balloon defensive turret. Like I'm building it over here, but my base is over there, so I don't actually know if maybe I should be defending that stuff. So let's put our... over here. There was a question mark over here too, wasn't there? Is it the bird? Might have been the bird. Do you need mana? You do need mana. Okay. It didn't tell me to put man over here, but I'll do it. Can I move the base? You think? I can remove it. Yeah. Who 
said that? Anadar, good to have you here. Uh oh, I may have broken something. There we go. Okay, <laughs> it wasn't letting me, it wasn't letting me build. There we go. Let's put it over here behind these walls. Yeah. Okay, and then we can easily uh, hook this fella up. Wrong button. Okay. There we go. Um, we need two balloon defensive turrets. Oop, oop. Balloon tower. Put you there, and I'll put you... Uh, I need more wood, is that what it was? Yeah, I need everything. I don't, I don't, there isn't, I know this bothers some people. Uh, there is not an option for this whole screen shake thing. Every time, like, the, um, every time you swing, things shake. And I have not found a way of, like, adjusting that. So, I apologize if that bothers you. This whole, that whole shake is, is, doesn't bother me, but it is kind of weird. It's like motion blur. Why do people put that on games? What's the point of it? Just, just like, I think maybe, maybe they do it just, just so that it gives us an excuse to go to the options and start messing around with things. I saw also in the, um, in some of the steam, in the discussion pages, people were already complaining about it, so I'm surely they'll take it off. Or at least have an option to turn it off. <laughs> to weed out the weak gamers. <laughs> <laughs> have motion sickness well yeah I don't think so <laughs> okay we need another another balloon man here uh, this way and we'll put him right there okay oh yeah I gotta connect him up uh, wrong one uh, tab. The reason because tab switch between these. Okay, there to there is fine, and then there to th there. We should be safe now. Whatever comes close to this turret will regret it. And if the turret shoots at us, it won't. I will keep silent, but remember, it's an anxious kind of silence. <laughs> I can make houses now. Build three houses. Okay, give me some stone first. The smell. True. Something really bad is going on here. I can see that. The monsters are coming out of this nest. What it's nest? Not about the monsters. Something much worse. As if all magic in this place. We have to destroy the nest. Otherwise, the settlers don't stand a chance. Otherwise, nobody stands a chance. What nest? Oh. Oh, hello. It's crazy. I kind of want to see what happens. Let's try this. You two are in my place. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. I want to be the her. Do I just sit there? And I can come over here and I can like burn things. Oh, he did. Burn him. Oh, that's way better. Anybody else? Way better. Done? Done, I think. Okay. Build houses. Purge the island of monsters and their nests. Sure, sure. Um, oh, remember, houses aren't made of wood. Houses are made of stone. 
Let's go find some stone. Can I come over here? Can I, like... Can I assist... Can I assist you in this? I can. So I'm making 300 a day. I can come help it out. I need... I don't know how much I need for the house. But I'm going to go ahead and just kind of whack on this thing a bit. A, a bit. And my, I, my mech got a little damaged. Let's see if I can go fix it up. We'll get 100 here. You know, Ice Melon, if you can't be civil, then what's the point? Alright, so I want to make a house. At a house? That's a house. Colonist house. Yeah, we'll throw them uh, over here. Get this tree out of here. There's something... Yeah, can I upgrade the mech? There's something I can do with it, because I got mana. So there's something I can do with the mech. I'm not sure what, though. So, I know I know there's something coming with the mech. I got three houses. I'm going to build a fourth house. Uh, no, I want not enough stone. Oh, they all need mana? Okay. Let's build a pipeline from, like, over here, too, so we have a second, a second one. here. No hunger, no deadly frost. No. Do you know how many have said this before? Generation after generation. It's good to finally understand them. Let's go. I don't know where that nest is. It doesn't show up on here. But is this... Maybe I need to... How big is this? Let's make a water well. Does that need to be near the houses? Do they care? Water needs mana too. Dear host, when we asked you for something to drink, you gave us plain water, you twit. For that, we will go to your well and right there, without much ado, take a. What was that? Uh, can I repair you? No, oh, yeah, I can. <laughs> that one's good. Wasn't there one that got... That got beat up? Chubby, chubby. Oh, that one's good, I guess. Okay. Let's go purge the island from monsters in their nests. I think I see one over here. Foul. Purple nonsense. Another quarry over here, too. Like an aqueduct up there? Maybe a bridge. Are you, uh, are you something foul? Kind of weird because it like it goes at different speeds. We have survived, and the clan council wants to send settlers here. So shaky. I'm a bit worried as well. But oh, who are we to criticize the verdicts of the noble council? They must have had their reasons. Well, they might have, and we have our tasks to dig a well. To build houses for the settlers. Who will get ripped apart by wild beasts. But at least we know where they are coming from. And we can destroy their nest. What's that? Dark stone. A concentration of dark magic. Maybe it would be better not to leave it here. You're right. I think that monster and stone are made from the same source. I 
examine a mysterious ancient tower. Okay. Oh, what else do we have over here? Those are my quests. In okay, here we go. Here we go. Ah. I can craft claws and chimneys. It purrs almost like a pet when it works. Okay. There's my characters. What's he doing? Tell him to stop that. <laughs> Why is he doing that? What's one over here? Let's go inspect that ancient tower. Is that the one up on the wall on the top there, you think? Up there? How am I supposed to get up there? She can do it. Can I just have her do it? I if there's a way around. I bet there's a way around. Um, oh, we can go that way. Okay. Yeah, we'll go around. You think it's AI voice acting? I don't know. I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm out of the loop, but I don't remember AI voice acting sounding so good. So, like... Um, like, not being distinguishable. That's what I mean. I'm almost certain that this is one of the ancient Escoim ports. These half buildings, half machines guided airships and served as a harbor. Doesn't look too damn... Look, Escoim ruins. They have stood here for thousands of years. Look here. This looks like some Escoim... Blueprint of some kind of thrust engine. I think I know how to improve my armor using this technology so that it could jump much higher. We have to go to the workshop to see if it works, or it will be a waste of resources. Ooh, I got some new shoes. Let's go inspect this tower. Right, is that something nefarious? Let's go up here. Remember, this is all playtest too, so who knows what's going to change. Hey, doggy. A slightly tainted fox. Activate magic fox illness. Look, this fox is acting strange. Oh, it's purple. Discoloration of the fur. It looks like the monsters that attacked us. Maybe it caught something from them. Anyway, we don't have time to deal with foxes. But maybe we do have time to see what is going on in these islands. Please, let's take a closer look. Oh! <laughs> I'm, so I'm, so I'm sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> I was just curious! <laughs> I didn't think it would actually do anything. I'm sorry! Mean dog! Ouch! Stop it! He won't let I can't get a chance to get a swing in! I'm real bad at time in this. You okay there, buddy? You okay? Okay. Pick up some berries. Whatever we do with those, we can juice up some mana here. Something's not right here. The tower is saturated with dark magic. This crystal is the source of it. Let's take it off. All the gearing looks good, but we need a navigation stone for the port to function correctly. Navigation stone? I read about it. Let's search the crash site. Perhaps the navigation stone is still there, buried among the rubble. But if we want to find the wheel, we have to look for it near the airship. Dwarves used such stones in their airships, haven't they? Yes. Ooh, that's why we are going to the crash site. Aye! That wasn't a jump. Here we go, here we go. And jump! Apparently I'm not very good at jumping.
Crash trail ends here. Navigation stone is not here. It must have fallen off somewhere else. We must find it. I have an idea where it might be. You fly now? Explore the small island and look for the steering wheel. So, oh, make sure he's in a secure location. Breathtaking. All right, all right. This view has no comparison to the closed spaces of the Great Dwarven Library. Okay, over here. Are you damaged? Pick that up. Okay. Um, so we switch over here. Switch to her. And where does she want me to go? Over there, like behind me? Back up that way? Yeah. Let's fly. Ooh, I can spin. Oh my god. Ooh, look at that. That's cool looking. Okay, going up. My wings are getting a little tired here. Praise on Tinty. Got it. Now back to the grumpy dwarf. Spinny spins. Oh, yeah, look at that. Ooh. Okay, back to the grumpy dwarf. <laughs> what is, uh, what is, what is that? Is that the tower I was just at? No. Oh, it's one of those teleport things. Whatever it is. Can I just... Oh, I can probably just do this, can I? Yep. Place the blue navigational crystal into the port. Oh, I gotta go back up there? But I just ran all the way down. I am um, I'm overheating or something. Maybe I should stop for a second. Okay, up we go. Let me get the navigational stone. It fits. Did it do anything? Nothing. Just as I expected. Wait a minute. The Eskoim also used mana. Let's connect a pipe and see what happens. I want... What was it? A man... Yeah, a mana well. Here we go. Connect it. The mana flow. There's light. What do you know? It worked. Well, and our first colony is ready. We can send a raven and wait for the colonists. Send a raven to the dwarves. How do we do that? There, it's jump. Why can't I jump? Oh, okay. Weird. Okay, so jump is when you lift up on the space bar. Not when you hit it. When you lift up. Ah, weird. Okay, so whenever you run, you can see I kind of squat. So I squat. That's me pushing down. And that's lifting, lifting up. Okay. Weird.
a little tap. Uh, where to? Over here? Yeah, send the raven. Out of here, bird. I have a good trip. I can't believe it. I hope he succeeds. He will succeed. I believe in it. The first colony is finished. But this is just the beginning. I feel like I need to repair this thing a little bit. Yeah. I think all that jumping off mountains is a little dangerous. Okay, now what? Meet the arriving dwarves. Are they up there again? Come on down here, don't go hang out up there. Can I get a bridge or something? I thought they're gonna crash. Hello, dwarves. Wait, come back. <laughs> the well can stand here until doomsday, but if you don't build a pipe connecting it to the base, it won't do us any good. I know, just a moment and it will be ready. <laughs> the traditional dwarf greeting of a hammer to the face. Place a workshop at the base. Find the right spot. Okay. Hit again. It's it's my my brain will not adjust. I'm too old for this to adjust that lifting up on space bar jumps. I can't handle that. Okay, uh we wanna make a workshop. I thought in here. Why do we do that? Place workshop at base. Like over here. Place workshop at base. What does that mean? Um. Weird music. Here they come. Place well, workshop at bay. What does it mean? I can't make a workshop. I'll put a raven tower out. Mortar tower sounds pretty cool. The Manitou Raven Tower. By the, door, by the doors, but the dwarves are coming down here. Find the right place. Yeah, hi. There's that, whatever's going on over there. There's a mana thing, there's a tower, there's something green. Oh, that's... Wait. Oh, there it is. There it is. Weird. Finally. A dwarf without a workshop is like... A drunk without a cup. It's a nasty way of putting it. But you've got a point. With arrows. Uh, high jump technology. Yeah. Install it. There it is. Simple and brilliant. Why did none of us ever come up with this? Look, I can jump so high I could catch birds in flight. But how on earth could we find something like this in Eskoim ruins? I have no idea. Maybe the construction of the armor is based on Eskoim ideas. 
Or maybe something really strange is going on here. Do I need to put that on me? Um, how did I go into that menu before? Uh, was it just in map? And then inventory. I just all my stuff. That one. Talk to the guild chief. He's up. Oh, he's over there. Something. <laughs> I looked at my mini map. I was like, something chasing me. I'm really bad at timing this. I just happened to look down and saw something purple right behind me. <laughs> what is going on? The music was getting exciting. Man, I just saved your life. I, the head of this guild, congratulate you on achieving your first task as first dwarf. I'm going to fulfill my duty to the end. True. While flying the ship, I sensed a foul scent from the nearby island. Perhaps this is a lead for preparing the next grounds for settlement. Thank you, Mother. Don't forget that convincing non-kin chiefs of other guilds will not be such an easy task. For the sake of our clan, I hope you succeed. I will succeed. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to intrude out. on oh. your warm family conversation, but your mother is right. There is a mysterious smell coming from that island. Oh, yeah, how do I do how do I do that? Get to another island, huh? Well, how do I? I don't have to like jump that, do I? Oh, okay. Ooh, that was close. I didn't. I didn't push forward any. It just <laughs> okay. Oh no, <laughs> I gotta figure out how to jump now. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't. I can't do it. <laughs> oh, good. Good. Uh, can I just be... <laughs> can I just be her? Let her do it. Let's fix this guy. <laughs> so close. <laughs> It'll be alright. Surely I have to jump on like like those little platforms. <laughs> Gravity strikes again. <laughs> My nemesis. This might be the end of, of uh, First Dwarf <laughs> if I can't make this jump. Okay. Okay. Where is it? I'm so lost. Okay. This way. Surely I can just jump from here and go over there. After those, those little tiny planks... Ain't no way. Okay, I'm just gonna jump and I'm gonna I'm not gonna run and jump. I'm just gonna jump and then try to guide myself onto it. Oh boy. I went right through him. Are we sure this is what I'm supposed to do? Gotta be another way. Gotta be. There's a big floaty rock right there. Can I jump on that? Let me go to this map again. Oh, hey, look. <laughs> Where did that? <laughs> okay. 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 Does that really connect up over there? I don't think so. Wait a minute. No, there's... Wait. Oh, over here. Okay, okay. I know where I'm at now. Now, let me go fix myself. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, jumping is undwarf like. Yeah, what was I thinking? This thing takes a lot of repairs. Should build this thing better. I'd say that I'm no I'm no expert. But I say this looks more like a like a gnomish invention. This is a gnomish mech. I think a dwarvish a dwarven mech would be like would have tank treads and wouldn't be all gangly like this guy. Hey Adam, how's it going? What do I know? <laughs> yeah, first gnome. Is that thing back? Or is it done for? I don't know. Is this... Is this... Oh, yeah, yeah. I just get up here. Let me go across. Choppy when we get up there. It's a little scary. Now, wait a minute. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, no, no. That. What? 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 Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, they do take a lot of mana, don't they? Well, I can't make that jump. Look up. Nothing up there. It's got to be something else. Got to be something else. The glowing wall is uh, means it's a um, a quarry. Get to another island. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> you, you have to toss me. <laughs> There's some explodey things going on over here. What's that big bright light? Oh, it's my my main. Oh, my tap my ravens. What are getting zapped? Highlander over here. <laughs> hey, crafty dog, how's it going? <laughs> That's my favorite. Tip, tap, tap. <clears throat> All right, so this is pointing me. I'm going to figure this out. Over here, it says get here. It makes it look like you need to do that, but that's nonsense. It, ha it has to be nonsense. Um, there's no way I can make that jump. I can maybe use these. There's a core. I can use like these little points, but that only gets me like, maybe I just be the raven. I just go there with the raven. Yeah, Warfu has an idea. Or not the raven, whatever she is. The dragon. Let's go this way. There's no way. There's no way that's what, what, what it wants me to do. It does kind of look like it, though, doesn't it? Let's go up here. Oh, this is it. It did. Look around the colony. Look around the island from a high spot. Build a new colony. Okay. 
going on down there. Oh. All right. Fine, fine then. I I was done playing anyway. You know, that reminds me of something that funny that happened today. When I got home today, my wife had put a sticky note on the fridge. And it said, this isn't working. I opened the fridge, it worked fine. Sorry, I'm sorry. For, for those of you concerned, my wife and I are fine. Please leave your comments. The YouTube algorithm appreciates it. But my wife and I are fine. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Anyway, there is the first dwarf. Or just first dwarf. <laughs> Sorry, that one took it out of me. <clears throat> oh yeah, marriage is fine, other than the terrible jokes. I I try telling her jokes all the time, and she, she just kind of likes... Uh, the other day I told her one. What was it? It was one that I told here. I forget what it was. She didn't even react. <laughs> I was like, did you hear me? She said, yeah, I heard you. <laughs> so I tell him here, and I assume all of you are laughing real hard. That's what makes me feel better. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> First Dwarf by Star Drifters. Uh, you can try to get in the playtest. I clicked it and immediately immediately got into it. Um, so you may, may maybe you'll have luck uh, and get in there. But it looks like there's going to be a prologue coming out here in a minute or not a minute but here soon um that we'll get to try um eventually but there we go there's my my star drifters and um i'm calling it a day thanks for hanging out and i will see you tomorrow and we'll play something else